there's this beautiful book the book is called as the six husbands every wife should have it's written by dr steven craig and let me tell you this is a must read let's talk about it this book talks about how a husband has to constantly grow evolve and renew himself at least 6 times by the time he turns 60 till then for as people grow their relationship and the relationships needs change the book's premise is that women do it naturally as they become homekeepers and mothers and grandmothers so here i begin the first change in a husband should be at the time of marriage the husband has to be fun carefree full of dreams and potential the couple should make each other laugh and feel good about each other the second change is after a couple of years the husband has to grow out of his carefree fun and life of every party ways he needs to get established in his career and begin preparing for a family obviously the third change in a husband would be when the kids come the husband has to learn patience be home as much as possible and scale down all his extracurricular activities and the fourth change would be when the children grow the husband has to again reinvent himself and be more focused on kids putting them first just as the wife does the wife needs a daddy more than a honey the motto must be family comes first and the fifth change comes when the husband needs to help children become gradually independent supporting them through their mistakes and growing up pangs he needs to be responsible and trustworthy and the last change in a husband every wife would like to see is by the time children leave home the wife becomes more confident and assertive now she doesn't need a strong but silent man whom she can lean on instead the husband has to become vulnerable and sensitive who opens his heart to her and values her as an equal leaning on her for strength at times the book brings to light that the very qualities a wife initially loves in her man are the very things that become a thorn in their marriage during later years if the man doesn't outgrow them for marriage is a lifelong relationship that must feed the family's emotional needs as those needs change a life partner has to be continuously reinvent himself or herself it not only makes our marriage better but also makes us better people and our life more fuller problems in marriage occur not because we are not good people but because we don't grow up how many men or women have the courage to grow evolve and change as the dynamics of marriage and family change when i see across there are a lot of marriages going for a toss i'm not judgmental about who being wrong the men or the women but here is a question a concern a challenge that i open it for all to think over seriously what it takes to be together and what it takes to part there could be more reason why you stay together than the reason why you are parting 
marriages are planned in heaven but you are the one you two are the one who actually decide to be together for life and that should not go beyond your control take control of your life grow evolve but do it consciously relationship happens they are happening with a cause with a purpose to make you full as life is a full circle every partner is associated with a unique partner is also with a purpose so to be together should not be that difficult than parting which is seen in the modern time i wish i pray that you take care of this and spread the message across so that there are more marriages more successful marriages more meaningful marriages than bullshit divorces thank you